rabies for a while was you couldn't prevent it. And rabies is a yes. fatal disease, right? So, you know, you end up dying from rabies. Yes, that now we do have, you know, protection as far as you can get shots. When I was younger, the shots were like 20 inch long needles that my understanding went right into your stomach. So we've come a long way. Now yeah, it's, it's not that anymore. <laughs> Common misconception. Animals wandering around during the day that are associated with being out at night doesn't mean they have rabies. You want to look for them wobbling. They call it the wobbly gait. Um, they look like they're drunk. Yeah, they look like they're drunk. So <laughs> don't go near drunk raccoons. There was a raccoon wandering around in one of our towns that looked drunk. And a man said, oh, poor raccoon. And he picked it up and it was like attacking him. It was like <laughs> trying to bite him. And he was carrying it like a baby all around the town, brought it to a park and it was trying to bite him the whole time. He's carrying a oh, poor raccoon, sick raccoon. Put it down, and then all these people started coming and feeding it water, and giving it food, and it found out that it was uh, had, had was positive for rabies. Yeah. So we we just have to be careful, right? And the biggest, and you know, again, I'm an animal lover. Like I said, raccoons are my actual favorite animal. I think they're the cutest things in the world. But I will love them from afar. You should not approach wildlife.